The creative team of the Crazy Creatives continued their project of teaching 11th grade students the art of making a film with a cell phone or a tablet. The workshop took place at the Dr. Norman Bethune Collegiate in Scarborough. The workshop was conducted over the months of March and April of 2018. The aim of the project was to remove some of the mystique around filmmaking, to show it as a tool of self-expression, and to unleash the latent creativity within the students. During the three-day course, the students were shown how to conceptualize a story, write a script, dramatize it, create a shot list, and then film it. Your group, why do you sit down and do a short division? You know what a short list is? To help him, because he's not exactly the smartest person, so he doesn't understand anything they're telling him at all. To shoot and to keep audience interest, where the character grow, the only interesting thing, the most interesting thing in the second portion is the growth of the character. The character arcs which you create, the character arcs, the character conflicts yeah. between. Don't leave the mother's wall out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Their media teacher, Monica Resnick, ensured that interest never flagged. The students were divided into three groups and each wrote their script for a short film. The students showed a ready grasp of the subject and wrote some very interesting scripts. Once the scripts were written, the groups discussed the script, created a shot list, and went out to shoot the film. One group of students decided to make an animation film. The shot lists were detailed, and the shooting of the films was a very smooth and creative event. Hey man, what's up? Hey, what's that? That's a ge geography test next period. I don't know what I'm doing. If I don't pass, I'm gonna fail. Do you understand any, everything you're learning in class right now? No, I haven't been paying attention actually. I guess right now we'll just film it like this, and then later I can like focus in on each individual person's face and stuff. Yeah. Okay. So, okay. like how we did at Tip. Yeah, like how we did at Tip. <gasps> Once shot, the students were shown how to edit the film using professional software. They immediately picked up the knowledge and went ahead and completed their films. Okay, right? So now you have to mark the end point. So you don't mark it here. You can edit it here, but it is better to mark it there. The workshop was sponsored by Canada 150 Funds from the Government of Canada and York University in partnership with the Toronto School Board. The end result was a success that proved the talent and enthusiasm of the students. The three films made by the students are included here for your viewing. house you wanted to use because my house is busy this week I was wondering if you're okay if I come to yours 
Uh, I guess so, but you have to leave by 5.30. Okay, that works. I'll see you at the end of the day then. Okay, bye. Dude, what was the answer for the last question? Oh it was, uh, 85. Oh, not six. Wait, wait. Isn't this English class? Is it? Dude, I know I'm failing. Yeah, I, I failed the test. Hey, Eliza, you ready to go? Um, yeah, sure. So how do you want to start off the project? Um, let's just go upstairs. Sure, okay. You want to listen to some music? Okay, sure. Pain's creeping through the back. Fears crawling through the windows. Waiting for them to attack. They say don't get better, get better. I'm working on switching them letters. Look, he's home already. Okay, here. Okay, hide here. Olivia, what was that noise? What are you doing? Why is this door locked? I hope no one's here. You know what will happen if they are. Uh, yeah, it happens all the time. What, what is this? Um, easiest way to say it is I have body insecurities. What, what, what do you mean? I just hate my body. You know, whatever, just clean your room. Thinking about last night. Oh, what do you have in mind? Maybe you could stay at my house until this whole issue is solved. Okay. So do you want to meet me at my locker at the end of the day? Sure. That sounds good. Stop bumping into the wall. Stop in. it. We're good. We're good. No, jump out. I'm gonna, gonna reverse this. Make sure everything fall out. Watch. Okay, this. Got everything. All the blues. All the boxes. All.
A friend named Paul Oliver, and his dad experienced something weird in his life. I said, Paul Oliver! Paul Oliver! We've got a helicopter here, Paul Oliver! Paul Oliver! I said, Paul Oliver! Paul Oliver! Hello? No, there's no one there. Hey man, what's up? Why so sad? I have a geography test next period. If I don't get a passing grade, I'm gonna fail the test. Do you understand anything you're learning right now? Um, no, I haven't been paying attention, so no. You're hopeless. Shut up, Oliver. What do you need help with? The test is on the five bodies of water in Canada or something. You mean the five Great Lakes? Yeah, I think so. Hey guys. Hey, Bart. Hey, Bart. We're just helping Nick study for his geography test at the next period. Oh, sounds like fun. Count me in. Sounds like a plan. Thanks, guys. You guys are the best. Okay, so we're gonna start with the names of the lakes from biggest to smallest. Okay, so that's gonna be. Uh, have you, have Wait, you ever heard hold of on, hold on. No, no, no. Biggest, smallest? No, no. It's smallest to biggest. No, no, no. It's biggest to smallest, okay? S H M E O. Okay, oh that's Superior, Huron, Michigan, Erie, and then Ontario, okay? No, no, that's no. That's the no, correct no, way to no, remember it. No, okay? no, no. Smallest that. to biggest. Schmeos. Schmeo. Last okay. year, my teacher taught me smallest to biggest. No, You're no, wrong. it's always from biggest to smallest. No, you okay? know that's everything. Okay. What? You see, you see all the different kinds of fruit. Okay. That's why I think it's supposed to be from biggest no, to smallest. No, 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 no. Okay? This Small order is correct. Do you see You're this graph? Do you like see this, this graph? Okay? This is how I remember it. Okay. This is how I was taught. Well, this graph proves you wrong. H M E O. You're wrong. Please, You're wrong. Guys, stop oh, fighting. I need help. Just help me out, please. Okay. Guys. What? What? Stop fighting. Okay, so I have another method for you guys. So this acronym is HOMES. Basically it stands for Huron, Ontario, Michigan, Erie, and Secure. And this is much easier to remember because it's an actual word. Oh, yeah, yeah, that is a better wow. way. Wow, so good. Okay, so it's Huron, Ontario, Michigan, Erie, and Superior. Oh, Got it? Yeah, Holmes, yeah, right? okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Homes, yeah, yeah. 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 Huron, Ontario, Michigan, Erie, and Superior. Yeah, you got it. I'm gonna fail. What am I gonna do? Well, I'm sure you'll do fine. Just don't worry about it, okay? There, there. Just try, and that's all that matters. I hope he does well. Yeah, I hope he didn't fail. Guys, guys, that geo test was actually a kitchen safety test. I got a 99. We just waste our time. Yeah. You have 10 seconds to run before I kill you. Guys. Okay.